Hey guys, good morning and welcome back again to your Run Academy Need English channel. I hope all of you are doing great, having a good time. So all those students who till now were not serious about the NEET 2025 preparation, all those students who did not start their preparation yet for the NEET 2025, now they would want to start their preparation but do not know exactly what to do, what not to do, how to start their preparation, what all things to follow, what not things to follow, right? For particularly all of those NEET 2025 aspirants, this particular session is for you guys. Well, my dear students, since you need to accept the reality that you have wasted almost two, two and a half months already, right? Now, there are only almost like nine months left when it comes to the NEET 2025 examination. But if you ask me this question, whether you can qualify the NEET examination in nine months, the answer is a big yes. My dear students, I have trained, I have seen those sort of students who even cracked this particular examination in six months. I've seen those sort of students as well who could crack this particular examination in one year. I've seen those sort of students as well who could crack this particular examination in two years. So it is all the mental game. If you are willing to dedicate eight to 10 hours every single day, if you are willing to leave the distractions, if you are willing to remain focused throughout these nine months, I'm pretty much sure if you'll be starting from now itself also, you will be able to do it. Now, my dear students, in order to start this preparation, you should have, first of all, an overview of the complete syllabus of physics, chemistry, and biology. You should know, number one, in your physics, there are in total 28 chapters of your class 11th as well as 12th, right? 28 chapters in total. When it comes to chemistry, there are 22 chapters, including the salt analysis. Okay. When it comes to the biology, there are in total 32 chapters. So my dear students, in total, I would say in your PCB, you have got 80 chapters. So in these nine months, do you have to complete these 80 chapters? I would still say no. You are not going to complete these 80 chapters in nine months. My dear students, if you are starting your preparation now, then you have to make the target of completing the entire syllabus till the January end. This has to be a target. So entire syllabus completion is not supposed to happen in nine months. Entire syllabus completion of PCB, it is supposed to happen. It is supposed to get completed till the January end. Okay, this is something which you have to keep in your mind. Okay, do not start your preparation uh, as if you are going to complete the whole syllabus in nine months. No, right? In just six months, your syllabus should be done and dusted. What you'll do in the remaining three months at the end, that is something which will be discussed in detail. So my dear students, first of all, you will be having, you'll be keeping one thing in your mind right now at this particular point of time, that is the entire syllabus completion should be done and dusted in January end. Okay. Now you have got some six months. In six months, you have to complete 28 chapters of physics. In the same six months, you have to complete 22 chapters of chemistry. In the same six months, you have to complete 32 chapters of your biology, right? Now it looks huge, right? But, 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 my dear students, if you break it into the weekly targets, if you break it into the monthly targets, it is not going to be huge. It will become easy. It will become easy. But my dear students, you have to accomplish the weekly targets, the monthly targets, which you guys are going to keep depending on your own convenience. Now, in your physics, in total 28 chapters to be done in six months. What does that mean? That means you have to complete five chapters of physics in one month. Similarly, you have to complete four chapters of chemistry in one month. Similarly, you have to complete five chapters of biology in one month. So in one month, starting from today itself, in one month, how many chapters you'll be completing? Five or nine, nine plus five is 40. Right, so 14 chapters you will have to complete in a month. That's how you have to schedule your weekly targets. 14 chapters, my dear students, in a month. What does that mean? That means in four weeks, you will have to do 14 chapters. That means in one week, you will have to complete three and a half chapters. Three and a half chapters are to be done and dusted in one week. Now, you must be thinking, how do we complete these three and a half chapters in one week? What all strategy has to be followed in order to complete one chapter? Okay, let me tell you one thing. Since in one week you have to complete three and a half chapters, 
make sure in one week you are not just following only one subject make sure that every day you have to give equal time to all the subjects physics chemistry as well as biology do not just focus on one subject on a given day no right so focus on all the three subjects make your timetable make your schedule in such a way that you give equal time to all the three subjects be it your physics be it your chemistry be it your biology so if three and a half chapters are to be completed in week one let it be one and a half chapter from biology let it be one chapter from physics let it be one chapter from chemistry right so in total you are completing three and a half chapters in one week now the point is how do you start completing these chapters my dear students there is a particular sequence which you need to follow particular sequence which you need to follow when it comes to the chapter completion because after completing the chapter you should be getting that confidence in you yes if a question is coming from this chapter i will be able to do it i will be able to solve it now how do you get that confidence for that purpose there is a sequence of the things which needs to be followed number 1 let's say you are starting with the mole concept in chemistry first of all watch its lecture if you are the part of offline batch online batch or the youtube student no need to worry wherever you are studying just study from there only but make sure you are being guided by the right set of teachers you are being guided by the teachers who have produced the ranks make sure that number 1 number 2 all those students who do not have any access to the lectures they must be thinking from where they will be completing these lectures my dear students on this particular channel itself your an academy neat english channel yesterday only we have started a new course right which is particularly designed for all the neat 2025 aspirants wherein we shall be completing the whole syllabus just in 5 months every single thing is detailed i just took one session yesterday right okay similarly uh, today it was ambika ma'am session or yavar sir session and tomorrow there are other sessions scheduled right so till your november and your whole syllabus will be done and dusted you need not to worry at all you need not to worry at all you can consult this free youtube series right you can consult it you need not to worry every single thing whatever theory there is is there in the chapter whatever problem patterns can be asked from a particular chapter everything we are completing here also right so if you if you are not the part of the offline batches if you are not the part of the online paid batches no need to worry for the lectures we are here to help you out now are lectures sufficient to crack this examination no i told you there is a particular sequence of the things which needs to be followed after the lectures when you will be watching the lectures you will have to make the notes on your own do not rely on the session pdfs again i'm repeating right you have to make your running notes you are supposed to make the notes on your own that creates a different impact in your preparation okay once you are done with the note making then go for your study material solving make sure whatever study material whatever dpps you are solving make sure those dpps are authentic right and over here no doubt you are watching the lectures from here now what about dpps dpps also i shall be providing you in my telegram if you are not part of my telegram be the part of the telegram that is you can search on telegram uh, wasim but chemistry official that is the name of the telegram channel wherein i shall be sharing dpps of each and every chapter with all of you okay no need to worry about that as well or if you are the part of some online batch or offline batch right i'm pretty much sure you'll be getting the dpps there only now after doing that you'll go for ncert solving ncert solving is must you know the cut off is day on day increasing the cut off is day on day increasing people right it is day on day increasing now you cannot just aim for 650 you cannot just aim for 620 you have to aim for 700 plus and in order to aim from for 700 plus in order to cross that 700 plus marks ncert solving be it the in text questions be it the exercise questions they are equally important once you are done with that whatever questions have been asked from that particular chapter right in the neat examination as well as in the je mains examination of last 5 to 10 years you are supposed to solve them and once you are done with that solving then go for the chapter wise mock test this is the sequence of the things which needs to be followed and if you are following this sequence for all the 80 chapters nobody is going to stop you in order to cross that 700 for sure i'm telling you and i said and i quote now people three and a half chapters to be done in one week and i told you exactly what kind of sequence which you'll be following lectures i must highly recommend you this particular channel wherein we are teaching every single thing in detail with the finest content which you can ever get on youtube you can check it out afterwards okay now as i told you till january end your syllabus should be done now in the february and the month of march these two months should be just for the revision just for the revision 
okay just for the revision do as many revisions as possible in these two months as many revisions as pos possible right as many revisions as possible you are not supposed to study anything new in these two months whatever things you have studied since you have completed the syllabus once so just brush it up how do you brush it up for that you need to make you need to start making the short notes for every particular chapter be it in physics chemistry or biology make the short notes from today itself those are going to help you out a lot when it comes to the revision if you have proper short notes i'm pretty much sure in the last two months you can do the revision five ten times if you have the proper short notes made in these six months till january end okay now what about the month of april my dear students the month of april should not be for studying anything new the month of april should be just for the full syllabus mock test and the all india test series full syllabus mock test and the all india test series should be particularly dedicated to the month of april right and my dear students if you're thinking uh, about our YouTube series, which we have started from where I would highly recommend you guys to watch the lectures. In physics, uh, Newton's laws of motion is going on right now. In chemistry, yesterday I took started the chapter, Redox Reaction Part 1, right? Uh, in chemistry, there is one more chapter, which is going to start tomorrow. That will be periodic classification. In chemistry, right, this is for physical, this is for inorganic, and this for organic. In organic, it is GOC, which is going to start from Sunday. Okay, and on Monday, it's going to be again my lecture. That's going to be Redox Part 2. Every single chapter, we shall be completing minimum in two to three sessions with the quality content, with the finest content, with the detailed content. You need not to worry. And in the bio, uh, the MAM has started the biological classification. Okay, even that chapter will be done in three to four sessions maximum. So you can highly, I mean, I, I'm highly recommending you that particular series, right? If you have, are not the part of any online or offline batch. If you do not, uh, if you do not have enough money to get enrolled into some offline or online batch my dear students you need not worry every single thing we can provide you here okay now what is the sequence of the chapters which needs to be followed in chemistry my subject chemistry that's why i have come up with this my dear students in physical this is going to be your sequence right in uh, in organic chemistry this has to be your sequence in your organic chemistry this has to be your sequence but i would highly recommend one thing do not start organic chemistry till you are done with this particular chapter Till you are done with bonding, do not start with organic chemistry. You won't understand the concepts of GOC without doing the uh, chemical bonding first, right? Similarly, you cannot study, uh, so you cannot go for thermodynamics directly if your mole concept is not done. You cannot go for electrochemistry directly if your redox is not done. So this is the proper sequence which I would highly recommend all of you to follow. Now, all those students who would want to be the part of our batches, our paid batches, our live batches on the platform, okay? Well, let me tell you, yesterday, we have started one fresh batch, which is the last, which is the last live batch for the NEET 2025 aspirants. You guys can still join in. The batch has started yesterday, right? And in, this, in that batch, again, your syllabus will be done and dusted till December, gen, December end or January 15 maximum, right? And the last two months will be dedicated completely for the revision. You need not to worry about the study material, about the DPPs. Every single thing is provided in the batch. On every Sundays, not one every Sunday, sorry, on all the alternate Sundays. That means after every 14 days, you'll be writing the tests and we shall be giving you the test papers, right? You are having the access to the all India test series as well, right? Which you will write at the after the end of the syllabus completion. One-on-one -on -one mentorship sessions with all of us, right? One-on-one -on -one with the educators, with the top single digit, double digit previous year rankers. So all the parameters which are required to crack this particular examination with a good score. All those parameters are incorporated in the Phoenix Pro Batch, which has just started yesterday, right? Link is there in the description box. You can still be the part of that batch, right? If you have issues, if you have issues, issues like if you cannot remain disciplined throughout this preparation, then definitely you need to be the part of the batch. If you can remain disciplined throughout these nine months, then YouTube batch is for all of you, right? Because we do not compromise on the quality content if it is the paid batch or if it is the YouTube class, right? We do not compromise on the lectures at all okay so i believe this particular session would be helpful for all of you so my dear students it's high time to kick start your preparation so start it from today itself because i'm telling you as an educator nine months are definitely enough to crack this particular examination with an amazing score so with this i'll be taking a leave take care god bless you all and love you all guys bye bye take care